Hi everyone. We're going to do a little bit of finger weaving today. Um, I started to make a basket out of manila. It's a little bit thicker rope. And this is basically what the baskets are going to look like. So I'm going to show you how to start off to make the base real quick. Videos can be very long. There's a lot of uh, different ways you can do it. We start off with a figure four or four different ways. Four strings on top of four strings centered on each. You're going to take another string. You're going to pick up your four and four. And you're going to start off around four. Again, this will be short and sweet. If you want to see how this is done, we'll do a full, a, a full length video on this, but the video would be for, uh, take a long time. So all you want to do is when you get that on there, you go around four, you twist. This top goes over top of those four, bottom goes under, twist. And you keep doing that all the way around, and I like to do that around twice, around all four. And once we get around all four twice, then we start breaking it down, each time twisting the, the string as we go around and going over top and underneath and then twisting till you get that all the way around. Once you get it all the way around twice, starting to make your base, and you can see the base starts there, then we start going around two and twist two and twist all the way around twice on that and then we start going around each individual one around once twist your rope around the next one twist your rope until you finally start coming up with your basket once you start coming up with your basket and this is a little bit thicker hard to do with the with the thicker rope this is manila uh, jute is easier and you can start seeing the shape of your basket so as you start weaving this it'll come in tighter the longer your strands are Basically, if your strands are this long and then cut in half, that's how tall your basket's going to be. So, the longer these are, the taller the basket. I like them about this size. This can be used for just about anything. If you're out, you can use, uh, when we start making cordage out of willow, out of, out of uh, some of our wreaths, these wreaths, when we start weaving with these, we can twist these into cordage and start making cordage on and braid these into cordage and actually do the same thing with some of these. So basically when you come up, this is going to end up eventually with these little strings hanging out the top and you want to finish the basket off. So that's what we're doing now. We're going to take our rope and we're going to go around each individual one. And then we go back down over top and out through one of our holes that we had finished off our top layer with. And then you're going to pull that tight. And then you're going to do that all the way around the top of your basket and you're going to pull that as tight as possible and then you'll start seeing your top of your basket finish off. So basically quick and easy finger weaving or basket weaving with either paracord, making your own cordage and then you actually can use smaller string. The smaller string is really hard to do. It takes a lot of patience. This right here, this little spot, this little tiny basket that I started here, um, that probably took me 15 minutes just to get to that spot right there. So again, finger weaving this is Manila making baskets from scratch with your wilderness materials or some of your paracords or your basic twine and, and jute that you find out there. Thanks for watching.